Thank you, Jen, so much. I have a quick follow-up on Peter's question and sure. then two more, if I may. Uh, if the United States and Ukraine are uh, so uh, close together, working together in close coordination, why does the White House say an invasion is imminent and Ukraine say it is not? Well, I think I just said that our assessment is the same as it was last week, which is that we're watching, obviously, tens of thousands of troops build, troops, uh, build up uh, at the border. We can't get in the mind of President Putin, uh, but obviously an invasion could happen at any time. But we have not made a prediction of that. The President has not made a prediction of the timing. Um, and again, uh, we'll let others asset, assess what tens of thousands of troops at the border means. And yesterday, Ukraine and Russia sat down for the first time in a long time, along with France and Germany, without the United States, and they agreed to uh, keep the ceasefire cease in eastern Ukraine and talk again in two weeks. Mm -hmm. Does the White House believe they can bring peace without the United States being uh, involved in the talks? Yeah, we, we fully support international efforts, including the Normandy format, which is what you're referring to, to de-escalate the situation and negotiate a diplomatic resolution to the Russian-led conflict in eastern Ukraine. We stand ready to support uh, any sincere efforts at, at progress from all sides. And of course, this is a positive step. Uh, one more, uh, Jen. Besides